Good afternoon, vlog passengers. It's Question Tuesday, the day that I answer four questions from three nerd fighters. Because that's, that's all I got. Intro. From Crimson 19, Christopher Nolan, yes, no, thoughts on the man in general? I'll be perfectly honest, I really don't know a great deal about Christopher Nolan. I know that he directed the most recent Batman movies, and I know that everyone's been saying that Dark Knight is wonderful, but I haven't gotten a chance to see it yet, although I have been meaning to. I had the DVD in my possession, and I've been meaning to watch it for a long time now. But the only movie of his that I've seen is The Prestige. Now, I did enjoy The Prestige, and everyone's been raving about Inception, so from what I can tell, he's a pretty good director. I don't have any particular opinion on him one way or the other, though. Book 5204 asks, How's life? Life is good. Life is pretty good. I would definitely recommend it. She also asks, so are you willing to do a road trip for the 200th episode? At the moment, I'm the YouTube moderator and vlog driver. The most popular suggestion for my 200th episode is from Weird Little Kid who suggests that I go on a road trip. So am I willing to do this? Willing? Yes. Able? Maybe. To be honest, I've always kind of wanted to do a vlog driver road trip because I mean, it's vlogging while driving. That would seem like the natural conclusion to come to. So I really like the idea, and I'm not at all surprised that somebody suggested it, but whether I'm able to do it or not is... Well, we'll see. Gem Llama asks, So assuming that movie ticket prices get completely out of control, is there any movie that you would give up your entire paycheck to see in the movie theater? Well, first of all, I think movie ticket prices are already out of control. Second, my current job is such that occasionally my paycheck is so small that I do have to give up the entire thing to see a movie in the movie theater. But that said, I also have to give up the entire thing in order to buy a book or go grocery shopping or get gas or get a haircut. So my answer to this question is no. No, there is not. I am not one of these people who believes that you have to see a movie in the movie theater in order to get the full movie watching experience. I think I can get just as much out of the movie watching it at home on my DVD player as I can watching it in the movie theater. So if movie ticket prices do get so high that I have to give up an entire paycheck to see a movie regularly, then I will just wait for the DVD to come out. Or I'll watch it on Netflix. And that's all the questions I have for you today. Be sure to tune in tomorrow for Event Wednesday when I will be talking about the 200th episode and the suggestions you guys have left in the YouTube moderator. Bye. I gotta tell you, the conservative arguments are just, just so classy. I mean, there, there is just nothing better. No better way to argue against gun control than to show a picture that is a flagrant violation of copyright law, by the way. A picture of, of Calvin with his pants down pissing on gun control. That is just, that, that just says, that just has a dignity written all over it. And I, you know, I've got, it's just amazing. I not the camera on. I didn't even realize that. Hi. <laughs> I haven't done the outro yet. I got lost in thought.